welcome back to the ranch, Dr. Uptown here. As uh, Christmas is quickly approaching here in a few days, I thought I would uh, let everybody know that I uh, hope to have a Merry Christmas, a Happy New Year. Uh, be safe uh, while you're out traveling. Watch for, watch out for the other guy, and uh, get there, get to your destination in one piece, and uh, get back home in one piece. Uh, otherwise, uh, we won't have you with us to uh, celebrate a new year with. I uh, brought out my Marlin Model 60. This is. Uh, was Christmas present to myself a few years ago. I uh, didn't have a 22 rifle at the time and uh, decided to go ahead and buy that uh, while I was uh, in the process of uh, returning back home. I found it and uh, purchased it. It's uh, nothing particularly special, just a plain old uh, Marlin 60. Uh, First Sergeant B does get out and uh, use it on occasion. Um, I have uh, considered going ahead and uh, Getting a uh, Ruger 1022 also, just simply because uh, the uh, Model 60 features the uh, tube-fed magazine, whereas the uh, Ruger uses a, a dropout magazine. Obviously, there's a few more options available when you've got the dropout magazine versus the tube feed. But uh, this Marlin's been a good little rifle; shoots fine. Like I say, it's uh, nothing special. Holds a uh, 15 in the tube, and uh, so far has been uh, a very reliable uh, firearm for me. Uh, if you guys uh, also are uh, uh, subs to, uh, well, at, it used to be uh, the Armory Guild. Uh, he's uh, recently switched to uh, Riz Arms. That's R-I-S Arms. And uh, if you remember, he, uh, a while back, just uh, recently purchased one himself. Uh, the difference is, is his is a stainless steel instead of a blued model. But uh, he does some videos on that and uh, how to break it down and stuff. But I uh, thought I'd go ahead and show you mine. I wish everybody a Merry Christmas. And be safe. And uh, we'll uh, talk to you later. You guys have a good one. Hope you guys find this interesting. We'll talk to you later and have a good day.